guide dogs. He's come to Crooks for the first time ever. He is doing absolutely amazing. Today we are at Crufts up at the National Exhibition Centre near Birmingham. We're in Hall 1 and it's stand 126 here at Crufts, so I hope people will come along and meet us. We've got lots of demonstrations going on on the stand itself where we've got our volunteers and our service users and our staff and of course our dogs all coming along to uh, share their work. And then on Sunday evening we've got a main ring demonstration of our work as well. So we've got Puppy Cam playing right the way through the weekend as well. So you'll see some of our little tiny life changers just starting out on their journey to become a guide dog. So on the stand, we've got our volunteers and our staff and our guide dog owners all coming along and they're going to share different elements of their work with their dogs. So we've got puppy raisers talking about what it's like to take on a guide dog puppy and nurture and bring that puppy along for its first 12 months. And then we've got our guide dog trainers talking about what happens when the dog transitions into training and all of the different behaviours the guide dog needs to learn to be successful as a guide dog. And then lastly, we've got our guide dog owners who are sharing their experiences of living and working with a guide dog and being able to explain to interested people exactly what their guide dogs actually offer to them. Our slot is at uh, 5.40 on the Sunday evening. We are taking the audience through the journey that a guide dog undertakes, starting right the way from the breeding programme through into puppy raising, through into training, and then finally into the partnership itself. And we're actually looking at demonstrating the power of partnership between dogs and people, whether that's a partnership between a puppy raiser and their puppy, or whether it's the partnership between the guide dog owner and their dog. It's all built on reciprocal trust and uh, relationship building between dogs and people. So today we've got things happening on the stand here behind me. In the morning we've got our demonstration team and their demonstration dogs will be starting to talk about their work at nine o'clock. Then we're going to talk about breeding. So we're going to have again some of our volunteers with some of our breeding dogs, mums and dads. Uh, and then at lunchtime, about one o'clock, we're going to have a demonstration from our dog trainers who are going to talk about how we train a guide dog to do all of the incredible work that they do. In the afternoon, we've got a question and answer session with some of our guide dog owners who will be accompanied, of course, with their dogs. And they'll explain what it's like to have a guide dog and what the dog does for them. And then lastly, at about five o'clock, we've got our puppy raisers coming along with their puppies. And they're going to talk about their experience as a volunteer and what it's like to live and bring up a guide dog puppy for that first 12 months of its life. We love to get out and about, meet the public as much as we're able to do, share the incredible work that, that our staff do, our volunteers do, and of course our dogs do. What a great audience to, to engage with and to share our work.